Hi there stranger, and glory to Ukraine. Today I will show you how to beat Rhino Beetle. Rhino Beetle is the first boss in Smallland that the player must defeat. The quest for it is given by the NPC Scotty. The player must overcome the Rhino Beetle and bring Scotty its horn. At first glance, the boss may seem difficult, but it's not. Its mechanics are quite simple, so even a beginner can handle it. Rhino Beetle lives on the beach southwest of Scotty. Its location is marked on the map with a special icon. If you want to see this icon on the compass when the map is closed, you can click on it with the left mouse button. First and foremost, make sure you have a flint spear. Flint for creating such a weapon can be found right on the shore, not far from the Rhino Beetle itself. It is recommended to use a spear in battle, as it is the most convenient to use and deals decent damage. Your character's armor should be no worse than stone. It also makes sense to create a stamina tonic, which will increase the maximum capacity of stamina and the speed of its regeneration. To quickly restore health in case of mistakes, create several health elixirs in advance and place them on the quick access panel. You can also stock up on healing patches, but keep in mind that they take much longer to apply than health elixirs. To create these potions, you will need an apothecary table. Bark for its creation can be found there, on the shore, and refined wood is produced on the stonecutter. Drink the stamina tonic before the battle. If your home, spawn point, is far away, don't forget to set up a bed on the shore so that you respawn at this location in case of anything. After that, you can immediately attack the boss. Rhino Beetle itself has only two attacks. First attack, it slightly rises above the ground and crashes down on the character with its full body weight, dealing significant damage. The attack happens with a delay, so you should wait a bit before dodging with a roll. Second attack, the beetle extends its horn forward and charges straight at the player, dealing significant damage. This attack also happens with a delay, so you must accurately time the moment when the beetle is almost next to you. Dodging this attack in time is much more difficult than the previous one. To defeat the boss, you should attack him after his first attack, when he becomes vulnerable for 2-3 seconds after a powerful strike on the ground and tries to recover. During this time, you can deal 3-4 spear hits to Rhino Beetle. However, I recommend not getting too carried away, so you have enough stamina left for dodging his next attack. The battle with Rhino Beetle takes about 2-4 minutes depending on your experience. After defeating the boss, don't forget to pick up the Rhino Split Horn and deliver it to Scotty. With this simple method, you can easily defeat Rhino Beetle. Don't forget to hit the like button on this video if you found it helpful. Thank you for watching. See you soon.